Rated M for Mature. The concept for Legendary came about because the people working at Spark had worked on World War II titles for about 10 plus years. So we really wanted to work on something fresh and different. We wanted to sink our teeth into something new that wasn't just human versus soldier AI combat, and run for cover and pick up weapons and different hit points for different weapons and that, and that sort of thing. We really wanted to do something fresh and spark some inspiration in the team. And what the team was really interested in doing was looking at non-human combatant. AI. And so Legendary was going to be a real break in sort of our history and what we had done and really give us a chance to really spread our wings and our talent in a new direction. My name is John Garcia Shelton and I'm the producer. We really wanted to take what our skills were, which were sort of action-packed first-person shooter, but also take on new challenges. And we really felt like creating the creatures of Legendary would be a really fun challenge. These aren't normal pop-up enemies. They're not going to stay in place. We've been playing through the game from September of last year, playing consistently through all the levels, trying to tune them and polish them and look for every last bit of clarity for the player, removing all player fatigue. We really look for things that are gonna keep that player playing for a couple hours and realizing, wow, it's one in the morning, I can't believe I've been playing this long. They lose themselves within the world, which is, you know, to me is really the, the number one objective. One of the things that we establish in Legendary is the signet that is branded to Deckard, the central character of Legendary. He's the player's character. One of the most interesting design issues that we had was how powerful we wanted it to be versus how non-fantasy we wanted it to be, and finding the good balance between it being a useful tool for the player Player, but also not something that overpowered all the other weapons or the other equipment or creatures or everything else in the game. So we ended up uh, going in a direction of making it more of a passive useful tool as opposed to another gun. The main thing we wanted with Deckard was a person who was disconnected from all of the secret societies, who was somebody who the opening of the box and the background of the box was something new. The look for Deckard was based really pretty specifically on Steve McQueen. We wanted a guy that looked really cool. And we wanted to kind of be a classic cool, not like, you know, like a modern cool or like a future Matrix cool. We wanted like sport coat, jacket, tough guy. Vivian is a character who's kind of caught in the middle between LaFay, the villain, and Deckard and she becomes kind of his guide through the world. We did make a very conscious choice to make Vivian something other than your standard generic love interest. We wanted to actually produce a character that was placed in a similar situation to the player. Legendary is about human survival in the face of incredible odds. It's about surviving the end of the world. It's about uh, preserving the human race and trying to save it from complete destruction. Seeing a scene where a human gets ripped to shreds is very satisfying. Yeah!